Hey Deep Divers, welcome back to Deep Dive Disney. My name is Eric. For those of you new to the channel, hello, welcome, thanks so much for joining us. Uh, to give you a little bit of a background on who I am, uh, I'm a former cast member of both Walt Disney World and Walt, uh, Walt Disney Land. Uh, I'm a former cast member of both Walt Disney World and Disneyland. I also toured the country with Disney, and now I'm going back and kind of watching some old films that I've never seen before or reacting to uh, different Disney footage that's out there and kind of just giving my insights on what it was like being a cast member in the entertainment department in the 90s. So that being said, uh, today I'm going back to what I kind of started doing on the channel, which was first time reactions to Disney films I'd never seen before. So I've asked in the comments the last few videos, um, what movies you might want to see me watch for the first time. And overwhelmingly, Muppet Treasure Island was at the top of the list. So uh, I'm going to watch that today because I've never seen it before. Um, I'm familiar with Treasure Island. I've seen the Disney original film from the 50s. I've read the book. Um, and I, it's that with Muppets. I know Tim Curry is in this. I'm assuming he's Long John Silver. I believe Billy Connolly is in this, but that's all I know. I don't know any of the other actors. I don't know where the Muppets are used as far as like, is Jim Hawkins played by Kermit? Or I don't know how they're utilized throughout this. Um, but I love the Muppets. And so I, and I like Treasure Island a lot. So I'm very excited for this. Then that's all I know. So let's check out 1996's Muppet. Tr I forgot what I'm <laughs> I forgot what I'm watching. Uh, let's check out 1996's Muppet Treasure Island. Here we go. Great. Tim Curry is a master. Oh, he's oh he's Captain Small. Okay, Miss Piggy's Benjamin Gun. Okay. Great Guns and Reserve as themselves. Billy Connolly is Billy Bones, all right. Jennifer Saunders is in this. Ah, I love Jennifer Saunders. Oh, so they actually have a kid as as Jim. Is this a musical? I didn't even think about that, that there might be songs. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Potato. Last night you forgot to put out the lantern. If you forget that again, there'll be no table scraps for a week. Easy. It's amazing in these old stories how just awful people were to each other. That's it, Steady. Yeah. I hate my life. I hate your life too. <laughs> oh. 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 I mean, some oh. family we are. Oh. Be serious, Rizzo. We don't exactly oh. look alike. Okay, all right. So I'm a rat, and you're a human being, and Gonzo's a uh, uh, whatever. Whatever. Oh, whatever. To the southwest. Pirate galleons. To the southeast. Multi-armed Zanzibanian shark women and their exploding wigs of death. To the northwest. Dirty dishes. <laughs> How does she do that? I will stop. I'll wash. Uh, yeah, I'll dry. I'll break. I'll break. <laughs> really did not know this was a musical. Having him sing in that kind of higher falsetto register just reminds me of Oliver for some reason. The British accent mixed with the, uh, it's just, it's where is love to me. Shh, shh. The black spot. <laughs> Billy Bones, it's me, Blind Pierre. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. The black spot! Ah! I'm going for that treasure myself! And no one-legged son of a bilge rat will... Captain Bones! He died? 
And this is supposed to be a kid's movie. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. Hey, Jim. Oh. Look. He's a treasure map. We're gonna be rich. Ha <laughs> ha <laughs> Okay, where does Mrs. Bloodridge keep the bullets? Oh boy. Come on, Gonzo. That's the bloody map. This kid is like a British Jonathan Brandeis. The map! Tell us where it is! Or die! Yep. <laughs> this is definitely a genuine bona fide treasure map. Oh, really? Oh, yes. Mr. Bimbo told me so. Mr. Bimbo? Oh, Mr. Bimbo lives in my finger. He's very Oh, my. <coughs> well, Honeydew with hair. Cute. That I will personally finance the voyage for the treasure myself. Well. Wow. Don't do that. Really? Certainly. What are rich half with sons for? True. Very true. No wonder I'm seasick. It's funny that the buildings are built at Muppet scale when there's people walking through them, so they look like giants. Take a cruise, you said. Oh, that's cool. Something smells good. Here we meet uh, Tim Curry. I'm afraid we shish kebab and barbecue stowaways on this ship. <laughs> 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 oh, God. We're going to have that kind of Tim Curry performance. I'm already excited. <laughs> Allow me to introduce my pet lobster, Polly. Pieces of eight, pieces of eight. <laughs> What's next? A singing, dancing mouse with his own amusement park? Woo! Hey. Another reveal. Yep. Hi, hello, everyone. Hi, hello. The raging volcano. He's a frog. Wait, hey, hey, maybe he gets hopping mad. Hopping mad. Boy. This looks great. I mean, it really looks great. That's so clever to have the two of them on the front of the ship. The thing I love about Tim Curry is he throws himself in 100% no matter what the project. He's like fully committed to this. He was fully committed in the worst witch, which is hilarious. A lot of this looks really great. Like most of this looks really great. I got cabin fever! I've got the tears! <laughs> wow. I don't know what I expected from a Muppet Treasure Island, but this was not part of it, for sure. I'm not complaining, but I was not prepared for that. Get out of here. Get him. <laughs> Grabbing the, dragging the claw. I should be locked up too, for letting thieves like them aboard this ship. <sighs> You're right, in you go. To think that they almost killed your little friends, looking for some daft treasure map. None of this would have happened if I'd have given Captain Smollett yep a dip a doo -doo. Anything can happen on Halloween. And so, my friends, the sea has claimed another loyal officer. Get Fozzie's drying the tears of the man inside his finger. It just feels so weird. You mean that Mr. Arrow's dead? Yeah, that. Yeah. And my pants are filled with starfish. That would feel weird. And me, I could have been a contender. <laughs> 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 That's my reaction to that joke as well. Mm. We're a festival of conviviality. <laughs> a festival of conviviality. Oh, Sweetum's holding him up. I was like, how is he flying? Come on, then, lad. I said this during Treasure Planet as well, but the writing of that relationship between Long John Silver and and uh, Jim is so great. The relationship is so back and forth and back and forth. Which goes back to the original novel, obviously. Good night, boys. <laughs> Good night. Wow, that's a real elephant. This is a hell of an entrance for her. 
Nice. Bonsoir, mes amis. <laughs> oh, okay. Ben, she's Ben Gunn. She, okay. Very interesting take on that character. <laughs> Benjamina. I guess they got a history. Old girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> and Ben for deliverance from damnation! God, he's so good. He's so committed to it. I was on a ship headed for Zanzibar. I got cold feet. You're a frog. You're supposed to have cold feet. <laughs> I'm a pig. I need commitment. Commitment? I'm a pig, I need commitment. Hmm. Hmm. We see you have boom boom sticks. Boom boom sticks. Bye bye. <laughs> now, Benjamina. What? Where is the treasure? <laughs> what? I love how in Muppet movies there are. Even in the ensemble of characters, there are recognizable faces from The Muppet Show or from other Muppet projects. Like, I believe that was Crazy Harry in the front there, who uh, has the... Oh, no, 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 that's not Crazy Harry. That's, um... That's the guy with the, the boomerang fish. I don't think I've ever seen a duet sung upside down before, so... Thank you, Muppets, for that. Although I didn't see Spider-Man turn off the dark, so... Oh, it looks like the final scene of The Goonies. I love it when Piggy gets pissed. <laughs> Fix the hair. Oh. Silver! Mm -hmm. It's always weird seeing a Muppet standing, like fully the full body. It's always a little. Ooh! <laughs> Does Kermit have a tattoo? You have to return to Bristol to stand trial. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, Jim. I got a terrible fear of hanging. Oh, hell, Jim. I can never harm you. You're honest and brave and true. You didn't learn that from me. I learned it from my friends, Mr. Silver. Now take your oars and row away. I never want to see you again, ever. Where to, Captain Hawkins? To wherever the wind may take us! That was super fun. That was very, very fun. Okay, so that was Muppet Treasure Island. Um, that was very fun. It was not quite as fun as I hoped it would be. Um, I think because the story is, you know, a, a bit convoluted as far as the betrayals and the violence and whatnot, um, it didn't necessarily lend for a lot of wacky comedy that the Muppets are great at, but when they would st stick in some wacky comedy, it sometimes felt out of place just because the story was, you know, moving along. Um, but the comedy was very fun for the most part, I thought. Um, I liked the music. I didn't know it was going to be a musical, and I enjoyed that it was. I thought the kid playing Jim was fine. Uh, nothing spectacular about his performance, but he was fine. Tim Curry, of course, was great. I thought it was surprising how little Miss Piggy was utilized in this movie. She really didn't have much presence. Um, but she was fun while she was there. Uh, so yeah, I had a really good time. I would definitely recommend checking this out, because... Uh, it was fun. If you love the Muppets, if you love Treasure Island, you should check it out because it's very fun and it's a nice, uh, lighthearted afternoon watch. I thought everything looked great. Um, there were a couple of times when you could tell there was some green screening going on and whatnot, but for the time that this was made in 1996, um, the puppeteering was, of, of course, great because whenever Henson's involved, the puppeteering is going to be great. Um, but yeah, the the sets, the costumes, the, the lighting effects, the water effects, I thought it was all really, really great. Um, very, it looked like it was a very high budget film, which, you know, with Disney behind it, it probably was. Um, so yeah, that was super fun and I definitely recommend it. Check it out. We'll be back next week with another video next Tuesday, every Tuesday. Uh, please like, and subscribe. It really does help the channel grow. We're almost at a thousand subscribers right now, which I can't believe. And I'm super excited about. Um, also, if you want to follow me on uh, social media, I do now have a deep dive Disney Instagram and Twitter. Um, I'll put the links in the description as far as where to find me. And uh, in the meantime, thanks for joining me and I'll see you real soon. Bye.